Joe Malva here at the Pavilion for TLB TV Overtime alongside Juan Herrera. You might recognize him from his segment, Juan Final Thought, but tonight he's going to offer up his best wrestling analysis. But first, the highlights. 90s night in College Park, fresh turp a College Park t-shirt playing off the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. And wouldn't it be 90s night without some Nickelodeon-style green slime? Oh, look at that, all over his hair. Now let's jump right to 141. Ryan Deal making his Terps debut, looking for the pin, gets it, shows he's the real deal, Terps up 9-3 early. Turning point of the match right here, Chris Perez, Adam Weitzel, overtime in 149. Perez aiming for sudden victory, takes down Weitzel, first three of 19 unanswered points. Despite the loss, things ended on a high note for the Terps. Yusef Hamida making heavyweight Fletcher Miller look like a lightweight. Coach McCoy loves it. Terps fall 22 to 19, but Hamida ends things with a bang. But before the pin, I was a little bit upset, but um, I mean, happy to get my hand raised and get, give us six points for the team. Um, and it wasn't enough to get that dual meet win, but you know, it definitely felt nice to get that pin. You know, I really liked Yusuf Amida's performance today. He really showed up. Even though he wasn't wrestling particularly well in the first period, he kind of got it together and was able to catch his opponent with the throw and get the pin. All right, so again, at the end of it, Indiana 22-19 squeaks out a close one over the Terps. Terps will be back here next Friday night at the Xfinity Center Pavilion in their last home match of the season against Northwestern. For Juan Herrera, I'm Joe Malfa, and this has been your latest edition of TLB-TV Overtime.